In this video, we will learn how to convert a Python script into an executable file or a standalone file that can run on Windows machine without requiring Python installation. Creating an executable file is beneficial for distributing your Python applications to users who might not have installed Python or we can simply use for creating portable applications. Convert the Python script into an executable file. We will use the library called PyInstaller. You can install it using the pip command. So just open your command prompt and type pip install by installer. So this will take some time so wait for a few seconds. As you can see it says requirement already satisfied. So I am good to go. So before we proceed further let's assume you have already written a python script that you want to convert it into an executable file. So this is a very basic python script to download the youtube video by just providing the link of that video now we need to navigate to the folder where the python script is located so in this case my python script is located in the desktop so i am moving to the desktop using the cd command so so my python script is located here somewhere as you can see my python script is located here we will use the pyinstaller command to convert the python script into an executable file or a standalone file. So just type pyinstaller and we need to pass one flag here. So that is underscore underscore one file. So, so this one file flag tells the pyinstaller to bundle all the necessary files into one single executable file. Next we need to provide the name of the python file that we want to convert it into an executable file in this name of the python script is youtube youtube downloader.py so just press enter so if you get any error like this typing package is an obsolete backport of a standard library package so and we need to uninstall it using pip uninstall typing so to resolve this error we need to create a virtual environment so just type python minus m v e n v and so i'm going to give you a name for our virtual environment so virtual so just press enter so wait for a few seconds it will create a virtual environment as you can see our virtual environment is created so let's go to the virtual so after you go to the virtual just go to scripts and inside this just type activate as you can see now our virtual environment is activated so let's go back to the desktop location as you can see we are now in desktop location so now Install the Py installer again. Now our Py installer is installed in the virtual environment. After that, if you have any dependencies in the Python script, also install that libraries as well. In this case, I am having a dependency that I need to have PyTube. So let's install that as well. So pip install PyTube. As you can see, I have also installed the PyTube. So now use the pyinstaller command. pyinstaller one file and the name of the Python script is YouTube downloader.py. So now press enter. As you can see, it starts building the executable file. So wait for a few seconds, it will take some time. And our executor file is creator successfully so to test the executable file so this will create two folders that is build and dist so so you can delete the build folder if you want so i am going to delete it so inside this dist folder open it as you can see our youtube downloader executable file is created successfully so let's test our executable file so double click on it as you can see it says enter the youtube link so i'm going to provide a youtube link here so i'm just going to pass the link of any youtube video and press enter so this will take some time to download as you can see my youtube video now has been downloaded So now we have created the standalone file. You can now share this file with anyone who don't have Python installed on their machine. 
so this is for this video and i will meet you in the next one